Hi, teacher. Hello. Present, teacher. <laughs> good evening. Nice. Good evening. Okay. How's everything, my friend? Yes. Hey, for I Voy a prepararme a tacita de café, ya vengo. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, teacher. Okay. Sure. Good evening, everyone. Today is December 14th, and this is class 22. The topic to study tonight is passive voice with the present perfect. Passive voice with the present perfect. Um, I was asked to, to remind you that uh, tomorrow they're going to send the the link for the Encuesta de Satisfacción so that um, you prepare, okay, for that. Actually, uh, we have to do it together on Friday, right? On Friday, we're going to work together like uh, the last time, but they will be sending it tomorrow, okay? So let's see, welcome to your English class. This is the first, this is the general objective. These are the specific objectives. And this is tonight's objective. Students will be able to provide safety measures to control risks at the production plant. And uh, in the agenda we have Find uh, the verb in the past participle. In the pre-task, we have expl and the, the explanation of the passive voice. Then in the task preparation, we have some exercises. In the task, we have dialogues and practice. And in the post-task, we're going to discuss a quiz. Okay, so that is the agenda for tonight. Let's see, right now, let's check who is present and who isn't present. Okay. Anaselmi Chavez. Anadelmi Carranza de Guzmán. Dani Anthony Sigüenza Ventura. Danis Adalberto Fuentes. Present. Excellent. Nice, welcome on board. Eduardo Ernesto Hernandez. Guadalupe del Carmen Lopez. Jose Carlos Argueta. Jose Ignacio Franco Medina. No, pero estoy en el trabajo. Que no mira que aquí estoy viendo la cara. Velázquez. No. Karina Beatriz Díaz. Present teacher. Excelente. Karina Elizabeth Villeda. Present teacher. Así le dice hoy. Present. Excellent. That's nice. Present. Present. Present teacher. Yes. Welcome aboard. Thank you. Qué risa. Tenía el micrófono otra vez. Alexander Bonilla. Miriam Claribel Jacobo. Lina, Lina Gómez. Present, teacher. Excelente. Pamela Beatriz Posada. 
Present. Excellent. Nice. Welcome on board, señorita. René Osvaldo Bonilla. Ricardo Alexis Fuentes. Present, teacher. Excellent. Yanira Guadalupe Gómez. And Rudy Josué Flores. Good evening, teacher. Present. Rudy. Norbert. Ah, Norbert. Yes, I was checking. Rudy is saying, no, that's not Rudy's voice. <laughs> okay. Ah, uh, okay. No, Rudy is not here yet. Okay. So, Norbert, tonight you have to stay, Norbert. Tonight you will stay with me, right? Okay. Yes. Nice. Okay, let's begin. Okay. Warm up. Find the verb in the past participle. Okay. Teacher, what is what's the okay. verb in the past participle? Is okay. present teacher. <laughs> Hello, how are you? So, oops, my document disappeared. Okay, let's see. The verb in the past participle is the word that um, is in the third line when you have a list of verbs. The present, simple, and the past participle. Last one, like write, wrote, written. Written is the past participle. So you have to find similar words in the box. For example, Sim. For example, we're going to look for in the first line. Go. There is nothing, right? But in this one, in the second second line, no, there is an. Um, if you see one, you tell me which one it is. For example, gone, we see gone over here. Mm -hmm. Or warn, must be people aware, warn. Another one that you have seen? See? Said? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes, yeah, said. Or caught. Caught. Uh -huh. Another one. What? Mm -hmm. Got. Got another one that you have seen. No, no. But people seek, sought, or made. Yeah, made. No. Right. Written. Another one? Learn. <clears throat> hey, this one. Now, this is not. It's the other is learned or learn. Okay. 
Um, so, thought. Read. Read. The first line. Yeah, read. 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 Bow. The first. What else? Hi, good evening. Hello, good evening. How are you? Hi, teacher. Hi, classmates. Hello, Hi. Anita. Hi. Welcome on board. Yes. What other have you seen? Uh, Bow. Bot. As to the read. Bot. Yes. Bot. It's true. Bot. Uh -huh. <clears throat> but, uh, we, teacher, teacher, one, one. Hello. One is okay here. One, you have found one. 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 Seen W O N one. Yes, where did you see it? Teacher, found. Found. Where is found? F O U N D. Where? Uh, the the letter F is up the first first line. In the first line. No, uh, horizontal. There's Yeah, yeah. This one. Excellent. Isn't teacher? Yes, that's the one. Uh -huh. Found. Okay. Excellent. What's another that you have seen? Recent? Yes. R I. Where have you seen it? I seen. You've seen it. R I S E N. Uh, recent, yes, where? In this, uh, in the four row. One, two, yes, F R. In diagonal, recent. Yeah. Recent. Okay. Bin. Bin. Uh huh. Taken. Taken. Uh, 
Throw. 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 Give. Spin. Uh -huh. Spent. Mm -hmm. Given. What is given? G I G I P D. Then. Okay. Excellent. Warm. Warm. Written. Written. Written, not written. Written. Three. What is written? Um, after the receipt. After the seat. In diagonal. Written. The letter T. The first line. The first slide, uh... yes. If you can mark it, mark it. Between um, sin or form? Between in form. Sing, sing. Gone. I don't see it. <laughs> Here, this one. Yeah. Okay. Excellent. And done, right? Done. Done. Mm -hmm. We have done. We have seen twice seen because seen is here. Seen, yes. Seen. Uh -huh. Oh, much. Yes. So, no. Um, yeah. Okay. I think that we found them all. Because Rex is not a word. <laughs> Rex is not a word. Okay, excellent. Let's move on. Now, why is it important to remember the, the past participles? Like read, said, worn, gone, sought, gotten, fought, Thought, blown, taken, thrown, been, risen, spent, uh, given, worn, seen, and written like this one. That I don't know why it got raised. The same as found. Found. Why? Ah, somebody wait. <laughs> Very good. Those, those are some of the participles. Okay, let's explanation. Explanation. The possible is used. The emphasis of the sentence is on the action, not 
on the subject. For example, your goggles have been taken away. They have, they have taken your goggles away. Who took away the goggles is not important. The fact that they were taken away is instead emphasized. That is the important thing. They were taken away. Who took them? Like, for example, when you say you go to the gas station and you want your car uh, tires, Okay, then the other one is like passive voice statements. We have object, have or has been, and the verb in the past participle. Have is have my uh -huh. safety goggles been stolen? Mm -hmm. Is stolen my safety goggles? This question focuses on the safety goggles, not on the person who stole them. Passive voice have has. Okay, they put here object, being verb in the past, but you say it's not object, instead it's a subject. Okay, so I'm going to explain it. This is from the manual. I'm going to explain it like Jose Jose used to say, my way, okay? So here we go. Okay. Let's come to this. Let's begin from the beginning. What, and what is the beginning? We're going to begin with the verb, okay? Uh, uh, normally we have like this. We have, um, let me see, activate, yes, it's active. Uh, the first thing is we have, seen. has, Seen um, the principal, the principal verb, my dear Nito, the principal verb is seen. Seen is the principal verb. Okay, because seen is the principal verb, we insert the auxiliary of the mode of the passive voice between. And what's the what auxiliary of the passive voice? Been, right? In. So we're going to put it between the two parts. Say, I'm going to move it now. Put in. We insert. In. What do we say? Has been seen. Has been seen. Ha sido visto. Ha sido no. Ha sido visto. Has been seen has been seen. Active, has seen. Passive, has been seen. Okay, another one. Let's imagine that we have, have eaten, have eaten. That is the active. Okay, where do we insert the auxiliary? Between these two. So we say bin. Bin is the auxiliary. Bin. So say have been eaten. Have been eaten. Han sido comidos. O han sido devorados. Have been eaten. Have been eaten. One more example. Okay, let's see. Have sold, I'm ill. Now, what, what's the passive voice? Insert the auxiliary between the two parts. What's the passive voice? Have not been sold. Been sold. Have been sold. 
have been solved. Okay, another, imagine that you say, have discovered, have discovered. What's a passive voice? Have been discovered. Discovered, have been discovered. This is the passive form. Okay, you will tell me teacher, ah, it means that have doesn't change. Well, have changes depending on the subject, right? Okay, so this is only the part of the verb. Let's see now the part of the subject. Uh, we have like this, let me see, I'm going to give you an idea. Okay, I'm going to remove, uh, I'm going to do this with this, check. Oh, I said nothing. No, I didn't say white. I said nothing. Okay. So, yeah, but I don't want red. I want yellow. So the color has to be yellow. Okay. Let's see. Let's put another one here. This this represents subject and object, okay? Uh, I'm going to make a Superman S here. This is the subject, and this is going to be the object. Okay, this be the object. <clears throat> now, what happens in a sentence is that the object moves in this direction. And the subject moves in this other direction. Okay. So the subject becomes what we call the agent, right? We call the agent. So the subject becomes the agent and the object becomes the new subject, okay? So uh, this is important that we change the positions. The subject becomes what we know as the agent. The agent is preceded by the preposition by. by and the agent. And over here, we have the new subject. This is the new subject. So I'm going to, call, I'm going to just call it subject. Okay, call it subject. In reality, we know that it's not executing the action, okay? So notice this one comes here and the object becomes a subject. Okay, the verb has this change from, a, let's say, have seen changes, changes to have been seen. Okay. Right? Have seen changes to have seen, and th there is a change in the sentence. Example. Okay. Um, someone has stolen my new book. Someone has stolen my new book. I'm going to make it bigger. 
Someone has stolen my new book. Okay, who is someone? Who is someone? Nobody. Somebody, nobody, right? Doesn't give us information as who the subject is. So when we make the change, like this is the, this is the object and this is the subject. Okay, this one goes over here and this one goes over here. Okay. So then we say like this. My new book My new book, what? Has, because continues to be singular. Has, has been stolen. Ah, uh -huh, exactly. And the auxiliary, been stolen. By. Okay. But what happens with someone? Because someone doesn't give us information, we eliminate. And what do we say? My new book has been stolen, right? My new book has been stolen. We don't say by someone because, I mean, it doesn't give us information. My new book has been stolen. Okay, now, so this is the change that we have. Another example, another example. Let's say like this, we say, Maria, no, okay, let's say, Maria, Maria's boss has promoted Maria. Maria's boss has promoted Maria. Okay, Maria's boss is the subject. Maria is the object. So what do we do? This one and this one change position, right? This one goes over here and this one goes over here. So the new sentence says, Maria has been promoted. Is it necessary to say by who? No, only the boss can, can promote someone. So it's obvious, not necessary. So we only leave it like Maria has been promoted. Maria has been promoted. Another example. Okay. Check over here. Jack has sold his house. Jack has sold, okay, his house. Let's say, imagine that we put here just. Jack has just sold his house. Okay, what do we say? This one comes over here, right? This one goes here. And Jack moves in this direction. So we say like this. Okay, we cannot say his. What is his? Jack's, right? His is Jack's. So we say Jack's house has 
just been sold. Again, we don't need uh, we don't need Jack because Jack is in the subject making the possessive. Jack's house has been sold. Okay. All right. Another house. Okay. So when you say like this, a scientist. has just discovered the cure for cancer. Okay. Notice a scientist has just discovered the cure for cancer. Then Okay, this is the object, the cure for cancer. And the subject is this one, a scientist. Then we move it here, here, and here. So what do we say? The cure for cancer has just been discovered. And because it's obvious that scientists are the ones that discover the cure for something, it's not necessary to say by a scientist, okay? The cure for cancer has just been discovered. Okay, so in the passive voice, the important thing is the action that happened, okay, or the result, the result or the action, but not the person. Who executes the action is not important. For this reason, and particularly, we eliminate uh, the, ob let's say the agent, when the agent, number one, is a pronoun, means them, okay, him, her, etc., because it doesn't give us information. Now, we also eliminate the subject when it is someone, nobody, etc., because we don't, it doesn't give us information. And uh, when we talk about arresting, arresting, the ones that arrest are the police. So if, if the ones who arrest are the police, not necessary to include them. Like Miguel has been arrested. It's not necessary to say by the police. It's not necessary because we know that the ones that arrest, are, I mean, are the police. Okay, so these are some examples. Now, do you have any questions? Guadalupe, any questions? <laughs> no questions. Anita, questions? No teacher, thanks. For the moment. All clear. Okay. Thanks. Don Ignacio, questions? No teacher, I'm clear. All right, excellent. Cari? No teacher. Then let's continue. <clears throat> the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to complete the passive voice from the manual. Okay. I changed the verbs. <laughs> I changed the verb. Maybe you remember that at the top there were some verbs. I decided to put other verbs here. Okay. So you can do the ones in the manual to practice later. So three, three new safety measures, what? What do we say? Have been implemented. Yes, Rudy. Have been. Have been implemented. Implemented. 
Okay, fantastic. Thank you, Rudy. Okay. Then my friends, similar to this one, you're going to be doing the other ones, okay? So I'm going to send you to the groups for you to do this together with your partners, okay? So we are only 15, there are like four people that are not present, well, five people that are not present because 15 includes me, okay? So I'm going to make four groups. The groups are beginning, please work together. This is page 11, page 11. Chair. Hello. Hello. Did you send the presentation? I think I have, but I am going to, let me see. I'm going to send it again in case I haven't. Let me see. Because I, I don't found. <laughs> you didn't find it. Okay. So maybe I thought that I had and I didn't. Let me see. Yeah, it happens, it happens a lot. Okay, sometimes I think that I have sent it. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's true, I didn't send it, I sent yesterday. Okay, I'm going to send it right now. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome, senorita. Okay. All right, and I'm going to send the other one, the other document. Okay. Okie Okay. Okay, number four. And then the next one. Um, Rudy can give the, um, the, read the central number four. Maybe. The new virtue boot. Um, let me see. Okay, 
the new say uh, the new steel tube boots have been making of engine leader have been made okay make it made 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 made, made. Mm -hmm. yes what is simple is made the same as the simple pass yes Well, well um, we can continue with Lupita. Okay. Uh, uh, number five has been has been the new safety officer elected. Maybe it's, has the new safety officer been elected? Mm hmm. Officer being elected. It's a question. Okay, and the next one. Okay. The next one is have the new. Have it has. Have it has. Have it has. How has? No, how. Okay, how. 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 The other is how. Is pronunciation is has different how pronounce has Well made. Has been asking, ah, yes, yes, made. <clears throat> Question Star. What? Uh, what? Oh, what uh, is where? Um, oh. what is it? What is it? Which? Which? Which the new Cyprio sister elected have? Oh, have the new, has the new safety has. office been elect? elect. The next um. elements is plural. Being 
word, 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 Lupita. Lupita number one. Number one. Uh, three knee safety measures has have been implemented. Okay. You too, Pamela. I do that the last time. <laughs> the same. Yes. No. Yeah, I, I repeat it again. <laughs> okay, Shandy. Uh, okay. No. Maybe Rudy can be the. We can go to the number two. Roger, Which one are you working on? <laughs> number two. Uh, the near pros have bought. Has been both. Uh, number three, the name safely Douglas are nice. There have been made well. Yeah. The new steel to boot had been made of genuine leather. And number five. Have the new safety of officer has been elected. Yeah, the has you use in the question. Mm -hmm. Has. Mm -hmm. Women of the field have been implemented. Have. Uh -huh. have. Y lo tres has. Okay. Uh -huh. Que me cuesta, me cuesta, me cuesta. Lo que pasa es que unos alambres no tienen y me cuesta. No, tranquilo. They will. It's okay. Okay. Number It's four. The, the new steel to a boat has been made of genuine leather. Is uh, have has. has has because talk about about but but plural has plural plural have have, have. Ah, is no. two boots. Ah, yes, two boots. Yes, boot. Um, mm. um, is plural. Um, as is singular. May a uh, yeah. Teacher, is the similar situation when you use pants? Exactly the same thing. Ah, okay. Pants are. Okay, pants. Okay, the number five. Um, it's a question. Oh. Who's has?
Hello, teacher. Only the page number 11. For the moment, yes. Ah, okay, uh, we are finished. You're finished. We're working, yes. I guess almost everybody. So in a moment, we're going to go back to. Okay, thank you. You're welcome, senorita. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, let's continue. We say new earplugs have been bought. Okay, new earplugs have been bought. Let's make it a little smaller, okay. The next one, the new safety goggles are nice. What do we say? They have been made well. They've been made well. Number four. How did you do number four? New steel to put mm -hmm. a big made Had of a new letter. Excellent. Have been made of genuine leather. Gen genuine leather. Number five, question. What do you say for number five? The new safety officer. Has they, has they. Next safety office being elected. Excellent, Pedrina. Yes, very good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Has the new safety has the new safety officer been elected? <clears throat> has the new chief of security? been elected. Number six. Has the new helmet been worn? <clears throat> Have the new helmets been worn? Number seven. How do we make number seven? Consent. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Have the new tools been sent yet? 
Measures been implemented, implemented okay. okay. It's a bad word. It's very big. Okay. The next one. Problems have been have been sold already. Problems have been solved already. And the solution huh? has already Found. The solution has already been found. Needs, no, needed signs have, have been posted. Posted, have been posted all over the place. 12, new security boss has been. Appointed. Appointed. It's similar to a new city officer has been elected. Okay. Oh, sorry. Okay. Bless you. Thanks. Exercises. Transform into passive voice form. Okay. You remember, need to change the order. And we have this one, only one, and then some questions. In, so you're going to be discussing these questions. Discuss these questions and change these sentences. Okay, so let's go to the groups and let's work on that. Yes? You're tired, Guadalupe, you are tired. <laughs> yes, and today is Tuesday, so we're missing three days, three days more. Don't worry, you will have the energies. When, when to do a transfer into a passive voice, right? Okay. People have collected the goods. People have been collected. No. People have. Uh, people have been collecting the goods. Um, I don't know if it's 
Someone can con con continue with the next one. Oh. Ah, but the company has signed the staff. Yeah. The staff. Ah, uh, we need to put um change, right? Change yeah. the ah. the order. Oh, the order. Oh, okay. The staff. Um. The staff. Train. Yes. Yeah. By the company or. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, and number three. They have they have write the report. The reports have been right. Only. Only change the. People have been collected the goods. The company has been training the staff. Included being. Yes, yes, because. Yeah, people have been collected the, the goods. Having. People have been. Yeah, people have been be collected. Collected. The company has been training the staff it's only it's okay carla what the number two company the company has been training staff yeah number three dear niñitos you are forgetting the order Remember that it is not only to transform the verb, you have to change the order of the position of the word. The goods have been collected. The staff has been, I mean, the staff has been trained, right? The staff has been trained by the company or only has been trained because it's not necessary. By the, the staff has been trained. The last, the first, like in the examples that I gave you. Okay. For example, the, uh, the number three is the report has has been written. Have plural report. Ah, okay. The report. The re the reports have been written. Yes. Okay. Number four has been. Uh, the candidate uh, has been. Been? Check. The new manager. Have have the new manager. The workers. The workers.
Has the new manager been introduced them or I confuse have the new workers have the new workers been introduced to the manager or yes have the have the workers been introduced to the manager workers uh, in workers been The product has, uh -huh. has been uh -huh. left uh -huh. here since last uh -huh. primary. Yes. Okay. Well, we can continue with 10, Rudy. Okay. Uh, a new fabric has been discovered. Uh -huh. Number 11. A new secretary have been hired. Mm, yeah. Has been hired. Ah, the new secretary, secretary has been hired. Sorry, has been. Has been hired. The, the mistake in the calculation had been correct. Mm -hmm. Yes. Being corrected. Mm -hmm. Incorrect. Excellent. You finished. Now uh -huh. you have to go and discuss the questions. Okay. Discuss the following question. Yes. Since last February, they have been left the worst the products. What's the products? The waste waste. The waste products have been left here since last Friday. Oh. The waste products have been left here since last February. Different. The waste, the waste product have been left here since last February. Okay, number 10. Come on, Carla, help number us. 10. Number 10, number 10. Mm. It's easy for you. See, they have <laughs> been discovered a new fabric, or new fabric has been this. I don't. I lost. <laughs> <laughs> a new fabric has. Been a new fabric. Net. Has new been discovered. Discovery. A new fabric has been discovered. Has been. A has new been. fabric. <laughs> okay. A has new fabric. Been. Okay. Has A new fabric discovered. has been discovered. Discovered. <laughs> discovered. It's similar to number 11. A new secretary has been 
I, okay, a new secretary has been secretary. A new secretary. A new secretary. A, a new secretary has been hired. Secretary. Secret, secretary. That's it, secretary. The, the secret, the, the, from secret. From secret, from secret. Secret, <laughs> secret. From yeah. secret. Uh -huh. A new secretary has been hired. 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 Yes. A new hired. has been has been hired. Okay. Number twelve. Come on, Ricardo. Okay. In the um, the mistake in the calcul calculation, uh, they have been correct. Maybe sorry. Maybe the mistake have 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 been corrected in the calculation. The mistake. Maybe. The mistaking the mistakes in the calculations have been corrected. Is it correct? Okay, the mistake in the calculation have have been corrected. Excellent. Okay, now you finish. Discuss the questions. Discuss the following question with. Okay. Topic has been discovered. A new fabric has been discovered. A new fabric has been discovered. A new secretary. Has been hired. Mistakes. Mistake. Mistake. In the calculations. Incorrect. The mistakes in the calculations can be correct. Okay, um, continue. Yeah, now the discussions. This. Discuss following question with a partner. A manufacturing plant standard place to work at? Dangerous place to work at. Uh, manufacturing plants, dangerous place to work at.
okay, if the factory plant it's dangerous, uh, all the co-workers have uh, uh, a bad uh, a place to work because it is hasn't uh, a protection. Manufacturing plants, dangerous place to work at. In, in my case, uh, no have no have the um, the plants. Uh, for me, it's the factoring plants, the elaboration, the 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 pro the product. Okay. In your case, uh... my, no, no, how, no, no, how plants. Okay, um, in my case, we don't have problems, we don't have a, a dangerous place, but I think we need some manufacturing plants, will be need um, a more safe security. Okay. Okay, a second. Uh, Will a safe program prevent accident? Mm. Uh, on, yes? In my case, in my work, yes. This is a program for pre prevent accident, uh, security, industrial security. In your, in your work? Yes. A safety program. A safety? Yeah, a safety, safety program. In your yes. Work. Yes. Okay. Yeah, okay. I think... Uh, a safety program prevent accidents. Yes. It's too necessary to know how how uh, make a, a prevention of, for example, how many times uh, these machines need a uh, a maintenance. Um, I think all the programs, uh, safety programs, prevent accidents. What do you think, Norbert? Hello, uh, we are finishers about the discussion. I don't know what. Um, Nice. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. Wait, this meeting is being recorded. Sorry, teacher, I had problem with my computer. I imagine so. Okay. Um, the number five, have, they haven't checked the application yet. The applications haven't, haven't been checked. Okay. 
Yes. Have they introduced the worker to the new manager? The new have has has the new manager been introduced? introduced? The, uh, yes. The number seven. They have taken him to see the president. The president has been taken. Hmm? Yeah. The number eight. They have promoted Sarah three day in her career. Um, Ana Selmi Chévez. Present teacher. Excellent. Eh, Ana Delmi Carranza de Guzmán. Present teacher. Excellent. Dani Anthony Sigüenza. Danis Adalberto Fuentes. Eduardo Ernesto Hernández. Carmen López. Present. Excellent. José Carlos Argueta. José Ignacio Franco. Present teacher. Excellent. José Norberto Velázquez. Present teacher. Nice. Karina Beatriz Díaz. Present teacher. Excellent. Karina Elizabeth Lleda. Present teacher. Nice. Carla Verónica Vázquez. Present. Very good. María Emma Catalina de Rosario. Martin Alexander Bonilla. Miriam Claribel Jacobo. Pedrina Ileana Gómez. Pamela Beatriz Posada. Present. Excellent. René Osvaldo Bonilla. Present. René, okay. Yes, yes. Great. Nice. Ricardo Alexis Fuentes. Present teacher. Rudy. Rudy Josué Flores. Present teacher. Okay. Nice. Okay. Let's continue. Okay, this is a dialogue that you're going to be practicing together. And uh, <clears throat> there are some questions that you need to complete and then an exercise that you need to complete. Okay, with that, we finish. Let's see. <clears throat> Gee, where are my safety goggles? Have they been stolen? I don't see them anywhere. Your goggles have been taken away. 
they haven't been stolen. There are new safety measures in the plant. They have been put away in their box. You've got to be kidding. What are those new safety measures about? You're required to wear ear protection, gloves, reflective vest, protection uh, belt, helmet or a helmet, a jacket, rubber boots, earplugs, store tools in proper locations. So my goggles and the other tools I left around here have been confiscated. No, uh, the new safety plan has been designed to prohibit scattered tools outside the tool room. This means that you are supposed to put away your tools while you are using them. And they are, that you're not allowed to leave them behind while you're taking a break. Is this clear to you? Yes, sir, very clear. I'll be careful next time. Teacher, what is scattered? Scattered is a placed in different, different locations. Like one is in the middle of the room, the other is in the corner, the other is in another place. So that is scattered, okay? Scattered. Imagine that you have one hammer here, a saw here, a screwdriver here, etc. So you have in different locations that is scattered. Okay, safety goggles taken away been stolen, safety measures. You've got to be kidding. New safety measures, okay? Protection, globes, reflective vest, protection belt, helmet, jacket, rubber, rubber boots, earplugs, store tools in proper locations, okay? Confiscated, scattered tools has been designed outside the tool room. You're not allowed to leave them behind. Taking a break. Careful. Okay, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, so you're going to practice the dialogue and answer the questions. Then you're going to be doing the last exercise. All right, so let's go to the groups and finish with this. And then that's all you're going to do today. Uh, read the conversation and then discuss the following question, right? Yes. yes. Okay. Uh, well, we first may I going to do uh, I'm going to read your your and Diego. And Diego. Okay. Uh, he, where are my safety goggles? They have been stolen. I don't see them. I don't see them anywhere. Your goggles have been taken away. They haven't seen. They haven't been stolen. There are new safety measures in the plant. They have been put away in their box. You have. You. You. You have got to the. To. Got to be candid. What are those new safety measures about? You are required to wear air, uh, air protection, gloves, reflective vests, protection belts, helmet, jacket, rubber boots, 
earplugs store tools in proper location. So my goals and the other tools I left around here have been confiscated? Confiscated? No. The new safety plans have been designed to prohibit scattered tools outside the tool, tool room. This means that you are supposed to put away your tools while you aren't using them and that you're not allowed to leave them behind while you're taking a break. Is this clear to you? Yes, sir, very clear. I will be careful next time. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Um, well, maybe Lupita and Pedrina can... Uh, Joel or Diego? Okay, Joel. Ana Demi. Hello. Hello. Are you Diego? Yes. Okay. G, where are my safety Googles? Googles. Googles. Had they been stolen? I don't see them anywhere. Your Googles have been taken away. They haven't been stolen. There are new safety measures in the plant. They have been put away in the box. You go to the beginning? Where are those new safety measures about? You are required to wear ear protection, gloves, reflex vest, protection belts, helmet, jacket, rubber boots, ear plugs, Story tools in proper location. So my goggles and the other tools I left around here have been confiscated? No, the new safety plan has been designed to prohibit scattered tools outside the tool room. This means that you, you are supposed, supposed to put away your tools while, while you are, aren't using them and that you're not allowing to uh, leave them behind. Rounds have been confiscated. Confiscated. No, the new safety, safety plan has been designed to prohibit scattered tools outside the tool room. This means that you are supposed to put away your tools while you aren't using them and that you are not allowed, allowed to leave them behind while you're taking a break. Is this clear to you? Yes, sir, very clear. You'll be careful the next time. Good. Okay. okay, and now uh, we switch with Rene. Rene is no. Okay. Okay, we uh, discussed that questions. First, what items is Joel looking for? Looking for? What I, I, items? What items to will? What items is you looking for? Uh, a safety goals because he has 
what are my safety goals? Google's. Yes, right. He miss he miss a uh, uh, safe Google's. Why is the new safety measure about? Measure about. Wear ear protection, gloves, reflective vest, protection belt, helmet, jacket. I think it's on the, on the second paragraph. Diego. Diego says uh, the rules have been taken away, they haven't been installed. There are a new safety measure in the plant, they have been put away in their box. Well, the the new measure is put away in the box. Put the Googles into the box. Yes, right. Okay. In your opinion, why should tooth be left? Leaching about in, in the production plants. Why should it be left lying about in the production plants? Tools can be careful about the use to outside the the tool room. But the principal is, is what you says is prevent the accident. Yes, prevent the accident. Mm -hmm. And what other safety measure is mentioned in the dialogue? dialogue? Mm. Princess. Can I? Well, she said about the the protection, the equipment, uh, the protection equipment. Mm -hmm. That can e that it is um, clear protection. Gloves, uh, reflective vest, protection belt, helmet, jacket, rubber boots, or gloves, and the well, in this case, can be the other safe, mm -hmm. uh, safety measure. Another idea or another answer? Does somebody want to share? No, I think it is. That's all. Okay. Uh, we continue with the complete using the correct passive voice form. Um, the technician had been Higher. Mm -hmm. Higher. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, the next the one. Me the mechanics have been. Um, I don't know what is the possible ship. Ship is a. Um, ship. 
Ah. With the letter E. Double P-E-D. Shipped. Ah, okay. Shipped. Shipped. Ah, okay. The merchandise has been shipped. The merchandise has uh, been shipped. Okay. Okay. Uh, next one, Lupita. Number three. For Pedrina, number three. Uh, well, number three, the problem has been solved. Um, the next one, really. Mm, is the letter four. The number four? The old yes. is happy cleaner. Have. Or the have. office has. Why should tools be ah, like close to reflective best? Reflective? Reflective yes. best. Or jackets. Jacket. Yeah. Rub rubber boots. Yeah. Air plug. Earplugs. 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 Ear 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 the production plant. Rubber boots, air, air, air plug, air plug, um, protection belt. Yes. Yeah. Uh, the question is, why should tools be left oh. left lying about? Por oh, yes. Can they are tirados? Los, las herramientas, ¿por qué se deberían de dejar tiradas en, en la planta de producción? Why? Why should they leave them like that? ¿Por qué las, por qué las deben dejar tiradas? O sea, no hay, no hay razón. Yo, I believe that this question is eh, that type of question that the answer is no necessary. What's the name? Yes. <laughs> I've forgotten the name in the questions that you say the sky, the sky is blue, isn't it? <laughs> and you don't need an answer, right? Then the same happens here. Why should tools be left lying out in the production plant? I mean, there's no reason, right? Yeah. No reason. The is disorganized disorganized uh -huh, exactly I, the question is not why should the people leave them but why do the people leave them <laughs> is, you say cascarita teacher sorry cascarita <laughs> Ajá, uh -huh, es eh, skin, banana skin. Banana. Y se, they say should, mm -mm, has to be do. In your opinion, why, tools, why, why are tools left behind or left on the floor? Why? It's not necessary. It's not necessary, right? When he says, what's the purpose of this measure? Is the measure related to the question number three? I hope not, but I imagine, no, sorry, this is from the manual, so I, I don't know. But I imagine that the question has to do with the dialogue. And they are talking about the measure that is prohibited to leave tools scattered within. Okay. So I imagine that that is the, the measure that the, that the person is discussing. 
Yes, in the dialogue. Yes. Yeah. It's because it's, I think that it's related to number two. It's related to number two mostly. What's the new safety measure about? And then what's the purpose of this measure? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. The purpose is the reduce the, the accidents in the plant or the production area. That's right. That's the purpose. If you want, you can go to the to the exercise so that you may have time to finish. What the other safety measure is mentioned in the dialogue? In the dialogue. Target. Target, yeah. And this is Analyze it with a Z. Yes, it's other later. Uh -huh. Z. Z. Yes. Okay. Or tips. The mistake has been corrupted. Hello, uh, we were finished the all the activities. You finished, excellent. Yes. But that's nice. Okay. I'm waiting for the others to finish. Uh, actually, I think that they are uh, like number three or four in the last exercise. Okay, in a moment, we're okay. going to go back to the main group. Okay, thank you. You're welcome, Lily. The problem has been solved. solved.
So these are the answers. Okay, so. <clears throat> Well, I hope that the, the passive voice with the present perfect is clear, okay? Let's go to call attendance. Anacel Micheres. Present teacher. Excellent. Anadelmi Carranza de Guzman. Present teacher. Nice. Danny Anthony Siguenza. Uh, Danis Adalberto Fuentes, Eduardo Ernesto Fernández, Carlos Aaron. Present teacher. Nice. Present teacher. Excellent. Uh, Karina Díaz. Oh, yes. I'm here. Karina Elizabeth Villeda. Present teacher. María Emma Catalina de Rosales. Alexander Bonilla. Present teacher. Okay. Cedrina Diana Gómez. Present teacher. Nice. Pamela Beatriz Posada. Present. Very good. René Osvaldo Bonilla Herrera. Okay, Ricardo Alexis Fuentes. Present teacher. Nice. Yanira Guadalupe Gómez. And uh, Rudy Josué Flores. Present teacher. Teacher, did you sign my name? Who's speaking? Carla Vázquez. You were looking at the screen thinking about the mortality of the crowd. <laughs> okay. So you didn't answer, but I know that you were present. So don't worry. Okay. It's okay. It's all right. Thank you. No problem. All right, my dear ones. Uh, tomorrow you're going to receive the email from uh, uh, from the institution telling you uh, about. The encuesta de satisfacción. Okay, so you're going to receive the link with all the information, the video, and everything that you need. Uh, and also, well, for you to study, to see it on Friday, we're going to be answering that together. Okay, on Friday. So you shouldn't be absent on Friday. <clears throat> okay, well, thank you very much for attending tonight. I will be seeing you tomorrow, okay? Only uh, Jose Norbert stays with me, okay? The others, good night. Take care of yourself. Good night, teacher. Thank you for good the night, class. Good night, teacher. Bye. Bye, Bye. classmates. Good night, everybody. Take care. Bye. Good night, everybody. Come see you tomorrow, okay? See good night. You. See you tomorrow. And be good, my friends. Take care. Norbert. Hi, teacher. How are you doing, Norbert? What questions do you have about the class? How can I help? Um, in my case, yeah. Como dice? Excuse me. Um, este, siento que estoy un poco, bueno, bastante atrasado en el inglés, teacher. Este, me cuesta bastante 
definir eh, algunas palabras. Eh, últimamente, esto, en estos días, he estado bastante eh, ocupado en el trabajo y casi no me he quedado tiempo para, eh, para practicar, ¿verdad? Entonces siento que allí, allí, allí necesito un poco más de mí, ¿verdad? Para poder practicar, para poder aprender mejor el inglés. Sí, yo he estado viendo que en, en las reuniones, <coughs> hemos estado reunidos y ustedes estaban en el grupo, pero no participaban. Entonces yo decía, bueno, ¿y por qué, verdad? Quizás está trabajando y solo está escuchando la clase. Y como eh, es el mes de diciembre, así, así le está tocando a muchos. Sí, a veces, a veces sí he estado trabajando aquí en algunas solicitudes. Pero igual he estado poniendo atención. Lo único que a veces me cuesta bastante definir. Por ejemplo, cuando usted hace alguna pregunta... O, o para saberlas entender más que todo eh, um, in something specifically that I could help you mm, in my case um, is in the is with the the verb de present de bueno, casi todos los verbos <ríe> yes. okay. yes. let's see let's see how if we can make some logic logical conclusions about this okay um, let's see for example You say, I go, or I'm going, or I went, or I have gone. Let's say, no, I was going. Uh, and I have gone. And I had a gun. Okay. I will go. Or I'm going to go. Or I'm going to, let's say, to go. Casi no se usa con go, pero bueno. Okay, I'm going to go. Uh, I, was, I was going to go. Voy, estoy yendo, fui, estaba yendo, he ido, había ido, iré, okay. voy a ir, iba a ir. So these are some of the conjugations. I go, I'm going, I went, I was going, I have gone, I have gone, I will go. I'm going to go, I was going to go. And also singular, singular subject. Probably singular subject. You have a singular verb. For example, if you say, She, she goes, she eats, right? Singular subject, singular verb. Or plural subject, plural verb. Those are things that you need to remember. Singular subject, singular verb, plural subject, plural verb. In the conjugations, if you're talking about past tense, use past tense of the verbs. But if you're talking about everything that is repeated every day, happens like that, 
use a simple present. Or if it's something that is happening in this moment, use the present progressive. If it's something that you don't remember when it happened, use the present perfect, okay? So just like this, okay? So because very specific, <laughs> yeah, it's not very specific, but I hope that these ideas help you, okay? Because what else can I tell you? Practice, do your homework. How is your homework coming? Have you finished the homework? Mm, excuse me? Have you finished the homework? The... Everyday homework, have you finished it? Have you done it? Eh, ¿A qué horas finaliza el trabajo? No, que si ya, ya hizo las tareas. Todas las tareas. No, eh, me faltan todavía. Tía. Bueno, entonces lo dijo que vaya a hacer las tareas porque eso sería más importante ahorita. Tiene que terminar las tareas porque el viernes es el último día y también tiene que hacer el examen final. Si no lo puede hacer, lo va a hacer mañana. Lo puede hacer hoy o lo puede hacer mañana para terminar. Ya, eso sí. Ok, teacher. Sure. Thank you. Well, my friend, take care of yourself. I'll see you tomorrow, okay? See you tomorrow, teacher. See you tomorrow. Do, do, do your homework, okay? Okay, teacher. Yes, take care. Good night. Okay, good night. Sure, bye.